Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I'm hopping on with a quick quick project. Um, just made this for Father's Day. Um, again, using up the empty bases that I have in my craft room. Um, so I just grabbed a quick little folio base and I used this collection that I've had in my stash for a long time. Hey Mister from My Mind's Eye. And I also had, what I have, the Femra pack, um, as well as the enamel dots that went with this collection. So that's what I used for this one. And I did use a rose gold uh, foil paper from, um, I think it's from Michaels. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Michaels. <laughs> I don't know why I'm drawing a blank. But um, I don't know if you guys can tell that it's a rose gold versus just a regular gold. But that's what I used um, to mat throughout this little folio. This was one of the ephemera pieces. I backed it on black cardstock and popped it up. This was one of the, oh, I also had the journal cards. So um, one of the three by four journal cards, I popped that up, but I did back it on the rose gold as well as the black. And then I took this from the sticker sheet that comes in the collection and just added that. This is an arrow from the ephemera pack. Here is the back side and it looks like this here and then it opens up like so and in the pocket I just added a couple of the journal cards. They look like that as well as this one I did mat on black cardstock and it's just showing you, I'm assuming it's really tiny. Can you guys see that? Um, I'm assuming it's supposed to be funny. Like, I, I don't even know. The toilet paper is supposed to go that way and rip off one square at a time, maybe? I don't know. You guys tell me if you have this collection. What is this actually supposed to mean? But I thought it was funny <laughs> for whatever reason. So that went in there. Um, this was from the sticker sheet and I did mat it on rose gold and then white cardstock and left it open so you can tuck a photo under there. It opens up like this. And I'll try to find, I'm sure I have a tutorial on this. That's usually why I have extra bases is because I do double of everything. So I'll look for it and try to add that in there. And then um, I did add this on top. So it's probably not in whatever the tutorial is, and it's just a six and a half by four and a quarter, and then scored at three and a quarter on the six and a half side. And then in the ephemera pack, there was all these little like tabs, and I have a magnetic closure. This is open if you want to add um, a tag or something like that. I popped up this handsome, and again, enamel dots from the collection. And then it opens up like so, and my husband is a Scorpio, so um, yeah, he's a Scorpio and I'm a Leo, so you know it gets a little spicy in this household. Um, and then a large 4x6 photo mat, and I'm shaking the camera again, but just a really quick, simple project. I will probably add a couple photos in here tonight, but wanted to get this out as soon as possible in case some of you are night owls like me and just want to stay up and do a quick little crafting. But there you guys go. Um, if you did like the video, please be sure to give your girl a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, please make sure that you do and hit that notification bell. I am almost to 10,000 subscribers. <laughs> it's making me a little nervous because I don't have time to put something together for a challenge because I have corporate visit coming up. So it might not be until like the first week of July that I come up with what, you know, we're going to do to celebrate 10,000 subscribers on the channel. But thank you guys so much. I definitely will have some um, giveaways. I just don't, you know, I got to research it to make sure I do everything proper. So that's what the wait will be. But um, thank you guys so much for watching and always commenting on my videos. And if you have this collection, let me know if you're going to make something or if you have made something. I'd love to see it. But there you guys go. Thanks for watching. Bye.